So I've pointed out a particular uh, prototype board that was uh, inside of Hewlett Packard it had a very strange hole pattern. And um, so I showed this to some folks and people were interested and I thought I would reproduce it. So let's go ahead. Um, I needed to make some footprints that were custom for this part. There's a clover leaf design and uh, then there's a very odd um, dual inline package design that has some embedded, what look like embedded um, features for maybe transistors, or maybe you can put an eight pin round op amp into this uh, hole location. I'm not quite sure what they had in mind, but that's what it looks like. So uh, this is all done in uh, KiCad. And um, here it is. I've kind of modernized it. It used to have a edge connector at the bottom, um, fingers for an edge connector at the bottom. I don't think anybody uses this anymore. So I put in a uh, 100 mil spaced uh, uh, single end line row uh, to add some type of external uh, cabling to the board. And yeah, here's, here's what it looks like. It's in the dimensions that will be uh, within the boundaries of a cheap PC board at the, at the various houses. KiCad has a way of doing a 3D view before you actually build it. It looks pretty cool. And uh, here you go. You can get 10 PC boards pretty cheap. So uh, yeah, if you want one of these things, I've uh, down below, I'll include a link to my share site um, where you can pick these things up. Um, but before I do that, I'm going to wait to get boards, make sure they, they look okay before I release it. So, uh, yeah, we just have to wait for them in the mail now. All right. And as if by magic, we have boards on our hand. Uh, so I had a, had a stack of boards made, I think I have 15 boards. Um, and they look like the thing. Um, it's a little bit difficult to see the traces around this funny, funny part here with this blue, dark blue solder mask. So you might want to use a lighter solder mask if you, if you care about immediately seeing what, uh, which thing goes where. Um, but uh, yeah, um, the only other change I really made to the board from the original was um, it had an edge connector on the bottom, and I've put on this little uh, single inline package, and it's all. It's all wired up to uh, to different pads here as well. So it's got some mounting holes and uh, yeah, there you go. If you want to get one of these, head over to uh, my share site and uh, get some for your own. It is unusual.